uh, it came to a point where I started having to ask myself a question. Do, do I know God or just do I have a relationship with God or do I just know God? I'm Kendall Graven and I play for him. I use this analogy a lot uh, in my testimony is a lot of people know who Derek Jeter is. They know what number he wears. They know some of the accolades he did on the field. But do you know his favorite movie? Do you know what he likes to eat? Do you know what he likes to do in his off time? And for me, I knew who God was. I knew who Jesus was. I knew what he did for me. But I didn't have that personal relationship with him. I didn't know daily. I didn't walk with him daily. Like if I was to know Derek Jeter, I had to walk with him daily. I didn't know Jesus Christ like that. And I had to come to that, that point of junior year in, uh, in college, just broken down at our uh, team chaplain's house and, uh, of baseball about 9 30 10 o'clock at night just went over there just just broken like hey i, I need to know god and uh start doing some um individual things with with him our team chaplain matt jolly and uh, we start meeting once a week uh, to do some discipleship stuff and uh, to grow and get in the word and and to become more knowledgeable about jesus christ and begin begin to have a relationship with him uh, i think that's uh the biggest part of my testimony there is uh, i grew up in the bible belt I knew, who, I knew who Jesus Christ was, but I didn't have a relationship. And uh, to continue to walk with that, it, it's still tough some days uh, with being a professional athlete. And I still have to remind myself that uh, that's the most important thing in my life right now. And uh, everything else comes second.